1717, now holding a disturbance 24 advised. Well, I think we're very fortunate here in Castle Rock to have a high level of trust with the community. The body worn cameras allows us to continue to build that trust with, with technology and with providing that level of transparency to the community. The body worn cameras provide the officers a tool that they can use every day. Uh, not only does it provide really great evidence that they can go back and review for the purposes of criminal cases, but it also provides citizens with a more clear and complete picture of what it is that they do on any given case. Hey, how's it going, sir? Going great. Hey, I'm Officer Smith, Castle Rock Police Department Traffic Unit. It's magnetized to the officer's shirt. Comes off that easily. The camera is what's called a buffering mode. So it is continuously recording for 30 seconds. So that if the officer were to activate this camera, it will actually capture everything that occurred 30 seconds prior to that activation. The activation of the officer's camera is either going to occur manually when he gets on scene and he manually activated, or it's going to get activated through one of those automatic activations. Like he has to turn the lights on on his car, or he opens the rear prisoner door of his car. And at the end of his shift, each one of the officers drops their camera in a docking station and that automatically downloads all the information. Now, the information cannot be edited or changed in any way on the camera, and it cannot be edited or changed in any way once it's downloaded. Castle Rock 911, where's your emergency? It's going to pull all that information that dispatch already entered, the officer that's assigned to the call, the date, the time, the involved parties, and what have you. It's going to attach it to that video so that we know that that video is associated with that specific call for service. Let's see your hands right now. Turn the left. Most officers embrace the technology because it shows people what the officers do every day. And the officers are proud of that work. You okay, brother? And they don't have anything to hide with that work. Most officers He's encourage people to review that video. But it also gives a very complete picture, just at an evidentiary value. As an officer, I can sit on the stand and I can try to verbally explain to jurors or a layperson um, the scene of a disturbance, that there's over turned furniture, that there's someone bleeding, that there's someone crying. Uh, or you can watch that video and you can see that scene and you can see that person who's emotionally distraught. You can see those injuries for yourself. That adds a lot more substance to the evidence that officers collect. The reason why I'm stopping you, ma'am, is uh, not sure if you're aware, but your registration tags are expired. We're in an environment right now where there's probably a very high level of criticism in American law enforcement. Uh, police officers embrace the body-worn camera technology because they're going to be able to show people it's not what you're necessarily seeing in the media. It's not necessarily what you're hearing from other people. The majority of the work that we do is good work, it's challenging work, and we're doing it right with best practices. Our officers are very honored to serve the residents of Castle Rock, and body-worn cameras provides that next level of trust and transparency for our officers and for the community.